All right, let's do this. Sure, we can build a Dyson Sphere on that. Don't tiddly stop. Got this. Everything here is yours. As one of Cosmo and the pioneer of the Dyson Sphere program, you will explore this cluster step by step. By using the resources here to construct the Dyson Sphere to provide energy for the center brain to maintain home life, starting from scratch. I have chosen a designated planet for you to start the mission, which has necessary resources for initial development. Now please drive the space capsule to the planet. So, my understanding is, we have to start on this planet, go to different planets, then eventually go to a different star system. Maybe you build the Dyson Sphere first. I'm not sure how many Dyson Spheres you want to build. I've never even got off the main planet. Well, I've got off the main planet. Before. Now you are about around. to reach the designated planet. All right. Let's do this. I've said it before, I'll say it again. What could possibly go wrong? Ooh, look at this. Nice little blue planet spot. Spot of blue planet. Oh crap, man of milk. <sighs> Alright. Oh, look. This so is Icarus, a lightweight nice. industrial mecha with powerful functionality. You can use the arrow keys or right click on the destination to control its guide. movement. Nah, we don't. We In don't mission, need any of this. You will manipulate Icarus to travel beyond the stars and oh. create miracles. Ah, uh, did. All you can right. Use the same operation to collect we're gonna resources, some trees, such as trees, gravel, etc. Whilst we're doing that, we're In the meantime, some stuff. hold down shift and right click to give a series of commands. Go research stuff, you receive several stuff items we after made. recycling the space capsule. Click the inventory button it's in the lower right corner of the screen going, to open the cabin to, to view them. Get rid of these trees, there was a chip, but there it is. You can hold down mouse Some middle button drag burning. to rotate the angle of view, or yes, slide the mouse good. to zoom in and out. Now we have energy! Look at that. All right. Well, the first you have thing created a mining machine to achieve I... ore collecting automation. So let's pick it up from get... the inventory or select it on gathering of yeah, construction that's menu to what I like to see. That's a lot of things. Insufficient required items. You can click the replicator button at so the bottom right of the there, screen so it's by to the open seat. the panel and manually replicate and these items. All right, Wind electromagnetic. You have established no, your first power grid. Uh, so no, Not all power first. facilities has its power supply. Uh, Use the Tesla to first. extend the area of the power grid. So for that, we you have done building the first power transmission facility. Energy chips, Tesla maybe tower. copper. It can carry out short distance wireless power that. transmission and expand the power supply. I'll area take some of that. Grid. Thank you very much. Click on to view the current. And now I've come to go find some copper. Look at that guy go. I'll tell you what the let's bring this. It's really peaceful. We got wind, wind power. We are moving on up in the world. So look at the bottom left, it gives you your coordinates and the time that we have until it is night time. So I have about five minutes until it's night time. Yes, I know. Fight. Whilst I'm doing that, I might as well have a look at the star system. Oh yeah, this is this is gonna be a long, a long ass game. Who are we gonna finish that is? I've never got a game like this finish before. Oh well, there's only one way to find out. Let's make some more of these. Yeah, all right. So that's gonna take a minute. So while that's happening, uh, check the technology up upgrades. Ooh, what's this? Uh, some more iron in there. So that's just making that stuff. We'll get this all automated. Let's go have a look for uh, resources. Okay, so over here we have crude oil, crude oil there. Oh, this is a really good thing. Uh, some coal, some stone. I told you the funny number, boys. 
the funny number always provides. So we've got all the stuff that we need right here. We don't even have to build that far. So let's clear out these trees because I don't want that to go away as much as power our suit. I'm gonna do a little bit of deforestation. Time to you know, deforest I commit deforestation on the planetary level. It'd be mad, like, if instead of having a massive forest, you just had, like, really big trees. It's like, if that, this was the Earth, and it was just, like, Mount Everest-sized trees, and just a bunch of them. I reckon it would be worse, to be honest, because, like, you wouldn't be able to get the fuel without cutting down the whole tree. And then that, well, that wouldn't be good, would it? So. Yeah, not, not good. Not good stuff. Looks like we accidentally took out the thing. Uh, pop that back in. Yeah, that gives us a lot of energy. Alright, are we uh, done with that technology thing? We are! Alright, let's go here. We need gears. Gears are fairly simple to make. They're just one iron ingot, if I remember correctly, and I do. So make that. And whilst that's going on, we'll set up our smelters. We'll put the iron smelters over here. This is another iron vein over there. You built a smelter, which can that gives us a good bit of access, I guess. Iron ingots and copper uh, ingots we need to make one of these things. Make the wrong and products get in and out of yeah, we'll make some of them. You need to use sorters and conveyor belts. Yeah, pop that there. Alright, technology-wise, yeah, we're nearly done with that. Oh shit, did not mean for you to go down. Let me delete stuff. Oh, there we go. Alright, so we have a few power things down. Alright, now, now we're now we're going to see the on the conveyor belt. Our first achieve full automation. Shit. Use the conveyor belt to move our power on board. Our first little bit of and the sorter can deliver the orders from the conveyor belt to the smelter for automatic smelt belt. There you go. Very nice. Lovely jubbly. Right, we'll pop that onto there. Pop that onto there. And we'll pop that onto there. Good, good, good. Alright. So at this end, thinking about what we're going to go with this, we'll have magnets at the end. Uh, the, the closest end. Because that way they don't get there. And we'll have ingots. Uh -huh. Now like uh -huh. this end, because we'll probably go into this. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Quite a lot of stuff. Speaking of ingots, we need some, so let's just go and steal that way we can produce the wind turbine, or energy. You know what, this is gonna go great. I can feel it. I can, I can just feel it now. This is all gonna work out just fine. As long as I can steal some tickets. Borrow. I'm gonna do a, a British Museum and we're going to borrow the tickets. We'll build the uh, wind turbines by the, the coast. Just because that makes more sense, you know, there's not really that many resources there. Yeah, right, that's not taking up energy. Where is it? How do I look at the energy? It's automation. Thank you very much. I'm very proud of that. Okay, we're going to need uh, energy, energy chips or not. Alright, we'll go grab some more copper while that's doing that. And we'll uh, check the chamber, yep, and we'll use the organic fuel now. That gives us a little boost. Oh, and we're going out of the summer zone into the night time zone. Goodbye, Mr. Sun. Get 30 copper, that should do us very nicely for now. As I say, I don't really have a massive idea what I'm doing here. We'll learn as we go along. So that's, that's why I like this game, you know, you, you just sort of learn as you go along. It's good fun. It's kind of, yeah, I like it. I do. I do like this game. I do. Alright, 27 magnets. Luckily, see, I had this all planned out. This is not luck. Oh, this is not a but, uh, yeah, we'll get 10 gears. And we need some magnetic coils. I want to get a good amount of energy production in the way so we don't have to worry about that for a while. So 
pop one of them down there. And are we constructing another one? Or constructing a lot of things. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Energy construction. It's working. We're doing things. Alright, we need rocks and tickets now. I know we can get concrete from it. So we just go around and gather up some big ass rocks. Ah, basic assemblers. Yes. Good. Alright, electromagnetic drive. All we're going to do now is go into the upgrades. We're going to get that mecha car. Which, uh, I know is pretty, I think, relatively easy to make. Yeah, relatively easy to grab. We'll grab some more copper while we're, uh, we're doing that. That's doing that. And then once that copper's done, we will make some storage units. We need some more iron, but that shouldn't be a problem at all. Right, can we grab it from here? Yeah we can. Okay. So I'll make I'm gonna say oh shh it's a wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong thing. Wrong thing. Make three storage units. Yeah, oh we have an extra snow now in case we have well pre that. Well uh we'll make that. Um, let me think. I wanna get copper and iron up before this little episode goes up, which I'll probably pop in the same time as a few other episodes because I'm just starting off in this series and I, I like it, it's fun man, this stuff is good. Alright, we'll uh, make another one of these, uh, we'll get some storage going, yeah, okay, this could work, this could work. You built the storage, uh, which can be used to store cargo. Oh shit! You can Wrong manually place. store or use the sorter to automatically uh, stock we'll the cargo. Place to that, just because that's magnets. And obviously, the iron will be spread out. It's too I want to get ahead in storage of this sort of stuff. For now, we can make some of these. So let's just grab like five. All right, we'll carry that across to there. Good, good. Okay, so we have our first little iron chain going on here. Okay, behind that we need a row of these thingies, which if I'm correct is going to make us... Well, that one I'm going to set up to... One of your on. production facilities is not powered. You need to keep it within the power oh, coverage area ah, and supply it with okay. power facilities in order to maintain its normal Right, works. well I'll pop another one of these along there. And I'll pop one of them there. Oh, we have another one of these. So I'll just move that. Move that there. That's fine. Okay, so what we're going to do with this one is I think I'll make this into eight gears making one, yeah, just because of uh, where it is with the iron. Get some more conveyor belts. That's 30 conveyor belts, that's pretty good. There's not anything else I can research without... Oh, well, we can, can research that, but that's going to be really hard and I can't be asked. Blueprint limit, 150 facilities, drive engine, unlocks mecha flight, okay, I don't want I want that. That should. That's the way we're going with this now. We're going to go get us some driving. So we need to go get coal. And what was the other thing that we need? Uh, okay. Well, we can make them. At least some of them at the moment. Uh, what are we lacking for this? Magnets. Can we grab the magnets? Might that how we can. Well, uh, we'll grab the coal. That's good. We'll begin burning some coal. So that shouldn't be too bad. Oh, look, the sun's coming up. We've officially done our first day in Dyson Sphere. And guess what? We still don't have a Dyson Sphere. Well, again, we're getting there. Like, I think that's a good bit of progress with that. We've got a nice energy system up and running. We're going to be able to fly. It's going to be great. And we can use some of this coal to power the suit. Actually, we can set up a. Instead of doing this manually. Oh, it's just... Yeah, I'll fly back, we'll grab some stuff, and we'll set up like a little coal mining facility. That might be quite nice. So we we'll need to get it. Actually, no, we'll get a copper one up and running. We'll put that on on hold for now. What I will do is I will take 69 magnets and put it in your purpose. Oh, 70. 
Are we one off in 67? I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Yeah, there we go. There we go. I will pop 70 back in there. Just so. No, just cause. Uh, and then we'll have a few different trails. This will be our iron ingot one. This will be our. No. So the, they will be at the bottom, the iron ingots will be at the top. Okay, yeah. This will be our magnet one. No, no. Scratch that, scratch that. The magnets one will be going that way as well. And then the copper one will be the one that's coming this way. Okay, so. All we need to do now is find a copper vein, which I know there was one earlier. I've just completely spaced on where it is. Oh, okay, I'll construction mode. There we go. Ah, here it is. <laughs> right in front of me. Alright, we'll get this set up, and I think that's a good place to call it for the first episode. Look at that. This is going to be great, and then I think once we've done this, do a thermal playthrough. And by the time that we've done a thermal playthrough, because I want to do a lot of thermal, I want to do a lot in this, in fact. I reckon there might be some good space in the tower. Or I can play some Elite Dangerous. But, uh, space travel. Space travel. It's going to be great. Alright, let's have a look. Is this thing done? It is. Alright. Oh, never mind. Let's rotate this around. You know what, I don't think I'm going to edit these first few videos, but you know what, if you guys like them, then you know what, yeah, I'll start editing them, we'll make this a proper thing. Alright, yep, that'll be cool. I'm not sure if I, no, I don't like the positioning of that. Okay, so, even if we don't get all the veins, we can sort that later, but I want the copper coming out this way, so that's what I should do. Yeah, that, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, yeah, alright, so we will drag this out, drag this out, we'll move this along to here, and we're going to have a copper ingot facility, copper ingot making location on this hand side, I want to make this, no, I want to make a smaller one. What are we missing? Iron. Okay. We'll grab like 100 iron. That's fine. That's plenty. And copper. Copper itself. Oh, we need to connect this up to the electricity as well. So we can do that. No problem. I'm not sure how you make blue ash as well. I know it's computer chips and I think it is. <sighs> the the copper. Neg magnetic <laughs> magnetic coils. But um, we will we'll get that set up in the next episode because I want to get this set up. Or we might get it done in this episode. I'm gonna aim for it to be about 20 minutes long. This one might be yes, copper ingots. Okay there we go. Set this one up. Can we run a track thing? No. no. Okay. We might have to change that in the future, but now that's all. Okay. I don't know what's gonna come back to haunt me, but that's the thing. Uh we'll, we'll need some more stone. We'll grab some stone. Whoa, what a joke. Uh blue and I see they've added a little update where it tells you how much is left in terms of the cup deposit. There isn't that much copper left there, to be honest. There's a quite a small copper vein, but we will, we will worry about that later. Let's get another wind turbine on, because I noticed that there was some energy icon problems. So pop that there. Right, so that's, that's good. Alright, copper ingots. We're going to have to move this. Yeah, we'll just disconnect that for the moment. Uh, we'll pop there, just a bit closer. So we can set a few of these up. Two behind, that should be okay for now. Actually, I want, I want to move this on. Yeah, 
Or move these along. Uh, one there, one there. Yeah, reconnect them. I know the uh, energy line isn't straight, but that's fine. Okay. Copper. Copper. Good. And then we'll set up these storage boxes like so. Stuff through the future. I don't know if I did that like that, but I guess that's okay. I'll just do it. Simplicity's sake. Alright, then what we'll do. You can now click the planet thumbnail button in the lower left corner sorry, the of the screen. Now? Or press the M key to try the planet view mode. We can now view the planets. Wow, very nice. I mean, I've been doing that already. Press the thumbnail button. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Look, you got our little factory. In the there. planet view mode, you can hold down the middle mouse button drag. Oh, rotate oh, the angle oh, of view. Nice. And hold down the right mouse button. Drag yeah, to okay, angle of view. Cool. Cool. Press M key to point to the front okay. to the north pole. We will ship some of these pickets. In the planet view mode, slide the mouse wheel to enter the star map mode. On to this trail. So that's where they're meant to be going. Uh, we're going to need to get a few more of these. Once this is done, I think that'll be a good place to call it. I keep saying that, but then I just keep going on. Oh man, this game. This is going to be a problem. You know what, right? We've got Valentine's Day coming up, and I don't see a better way to spend it. This is going to be great. I know that sounds really bad, but honestly, man, this game. I haven't played a space game in a while, and I am beginning to not know why I've been like, missing it. Because I just forgot how fun this stuff is sometimes. <laughs> well, we've got a problem. <laughs> the shit ain't long enough. Oh no. The first of many problems. Okay, what we'll do is we'll switch the wires over. Um, bring it back closer, maybe. We can't, we can't. Alright, now that's good, that's good, we're fine, we're fine. I think it was only off by one, or at least that's what it it looked like to me. Look, it only looked to be one off to me, but I don't know. Find out. A little bit of luck. Alright, so that's from them. Can we drive directly from the front? No. Okay, that's fine. So we will just drag the Ingus, we wanted the. Uh, I wanted, yes, I wanted to make the gears of this end. Is that not going to go too many places for now? Very simple, plus the buff that this is going to become. Uh, and then we're going to need to drag into there, into there. Well, that will use two, just because, you know, that'll be a decreased rate, I imagine. And then. We drag them out there. Yeah, okay. Pull them out there. Pull it on there. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, pull them out there. Alright. Uh, we need to make sure that we're filtering the right stuff. Put that there. Uh, it's going to be a magnet one. Oh, we're going to need to get rid of one of these wires. Uh, we'll get rid of no, 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 we won't. We'll keep that one. And we'll get rid of this one because it just makes more sense, I guess. Uh, yep, set that up. Linkity link, link, link. And we have iron, copper. That should be set up whatever the hell we want. So, yep, there we go. Okay, that one's making that. This one's making that. And this one's making that. Well, I'll be damned. We did a thing. They worked. So, improvised thing. But that is now making stuff. Magnets are being carried in. You don't see any problems there. I uh, see so a problem with iron. We, you know, we were expecting that. So that might decrease the rate a bit. But I'm hoping when we upgrade. 
two level two ones, and that that will solve that problem. And also, maybe if we can uh, give it a little bit of power boost, which looks like. Yeah, that might work. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I think that's a good place to end the first episode. I will see you guys all later. Enjoy your night.